Alright y'all, this is it. I'm about to put all this in the pot and make the meatloaf. This is the dash I was referring to. Yes, the good stuff. My husband likes a pack and a half of this inside the meatloaf, more flavor. But, but do it to your, your liking of taste. You know, do it to the liking of your taste. You can handle half a pack. I'm trying to get the glare out. You can go ahead and do that. And then I'm a, I'm just going to put the egg yolk in it. Not the yolk, I'm sorry. The the white. The white yeah, the, of the egg. The clear part. Not that yellow part. Because that's too much cholesterol. I got the onions in there. I got my other onions on the side here. I'll just put... Um, ooh, do I have one open? <laughs> Look, it's been busy. It's in the bedroom. Because <laughs> I was eating in there. I put some of this in there. These onions are so good. Taste it, of course, because a lot of us taste before we go and fix food. But I don't know. I'm a, I'm a little bit like Rachel Ray. I kind of eyeball it. You see there? Almost a cup. Almost a cup or so. I'm putting a little extra because I can taste that salt like I want to. Um, yeah, that's a big hole. <laughs> Don't go everywhere. That's a lot. That's, that should hit it good. Now, warning. If you are, um, if you, you know, you might want to back away a little bit when you put this in your food because it is strong, okay? Like I might, I don't know, I might sneeze. See, <laughs> open it with my mouth. <laughs> See, <laughs> have a free hand and stay downwind before you put this in your food. <laughs> I'm open this mess of my mouth. Have someone help you because I, you know, <laughs> it's so wrong. I'm getting this ready. Oh, gosh. And everything I eat, when it's done, I pour some olive oil over it. That was my nutritionist, her helping and telling me that's what she recommends. And and it helps with weight loss. But as I was saying to y'all before, um, you have to find out what works for you. You know, what works for me may help you. You may need more salt. You may need less salt. You may need to not have even think about salt. It's a spoon when you need one. All right, here we go. And then you're going to mix this up. Take your time mixing up. Now, I'm starting at a possibly a, a weird hour. So I'm starting, I'm, I'm mixing this up. So like a 12.42. So what you do is, let's see, let go 12 something. One something, two. I like to make sure my meatloaf has like a little burnt on the top. But you may want you just get it. Get it before it gets really dark. That kind of thing. I'm just starting to start it a little bit. I got to put a little bit more seasoning in here. Oh, honey. Lord, do I dare open it? I'm going to try to open it away from my face. Oh. That was not good. Ooh, that was a mistake. Alright, half. Should we should put it all in there and see what happens. <laughs> see what happens if we put put more than we usually put. So I put almost half. Almost half. Because my husband said, you know. Yeah, he you can't see him. He's he's, he's fanning his face right now. Because like when you pour, you pour it out, it's good seasoning. I'm not coming for you, Mrs. Dash. It's very good, but it's when you pour it in, just try not to be right over the pot when you do it because it's, it'll smack you in the face. All right. I wanted to do an egg for the people. Here, can you just hold this, my dear husband, right here at the pot? Just like that is excellent. You are an awesome cameraman. Awesome. I'm going to open up an egg for the people so they know do not put this whole egg in your food. The yolk is not your, your friend. Even Jesus said he talked about he will break a yolk. I learned from Rachel Ray. So take your time. Pull it back a little bit, babe. There you go. Do it a little dance. Don't let that big old honk of yellow go in your food. 
okay you might want to do one or two eggs but no you know just the egg uh what is the egg white that makes sense and this i sometimes i just either flush it or you know not flush it i make it go down in the um sink or how we get disposed of it and then just simply mix this up and um, take your time, because I know everybody want to jump out the boat of food here. Take it. Sometimes I just start on one side, and I just like slowly mix it. Eventually, I will get a mixer, and this will be super duper fun. And hopefully, I'll remember once this is done to let y'all see what it looks like. Thank you. This is what one of the things we eat. Oh, wait a minute. Before I go away, duh, I almost forgot the important part. You gotta have all this to hold it together. I have a little pull back a little thank you darling a little bit of oatmeal what are we doing the oatmeal is your friend i think that's barely barely uh, barely a half a cup you want a little two or to your eye just barely want to make sure this is all comes together this replaces bread okay hopefully i will remember and not be a pig show you what this looks like when it is done i'm so glad i was able to finally bring it to you take your time mixing and combining so everybody is not looking like this this is not what you want to cook you want all this to be mixed in you can take a little time start on one side of the pan like this take your time you know take your time try to keep everybody inside the boat and inside the pot start in another corner just start stirring her around look at that See, I've been here before. My arm is ready today. Get her before people trying what you're trying to do is combine everything. See that? Take your time. Somebody fall out, you might want you might not want to put in your pot. Now you might not want it to go in the meal. There we go. I'm about to get this done for real, y'all. Sometimes I put a little bit of this inside, sometimes, or on top when it's done. Sometime I throw these in, and this is you can see what that says. That's uh, 50, half a can is uh, 55, and you can see hopefully the sodium. You know, if we eat, if we eat, not don't eat all uh, what you enjoy only. If you know, I know a doctor told me, you know, when you want snack, and oh, we don't have nothing to show you because my husband's eating it. You can have, you know, all the baked chicken you want. And that's where Mrs. Dash is well. Let me get it down for you. Mrs. Dash, I use this one. This is the one I use. Um, because it's blended where it is. The, the original is not uh, chopped fine. This is really finely chopped. And so I usually use this for my meatloaf. But when I found this, when I found that other Mrs. Dash, I said, let's try it, true. So... As you can see, I'm mixing her. See, take your time. I must be ready today. Usually I have stuff flopping off the pot. Mix her up. Make sure she is combined, honey. Make sure everybody go together. Oops, see, I lost somebody. Somebody jumped out. That's all right. I ain't eating nothing off the floor. Nope. I'm good. Some people like pick it up. No, that's okay. We are vlogging. Don't, don't eat off the floor. If you want to, then that's between you and yourself. That's okay. I don't have to do I'm not doing that. She's really combined. I used to use my hand. You got some nice gloves. That's fun. Okay, hold on. Don't move the camera. Just stay right there. And then come put it all in the pot. husband does this so awesome and he smooths it out all special I mean hey you know, I ain't, I ain't gonna no hate throw hate that I don't know hate he's just he just does some things better than me but no, honey can you smooth it let me stop talking about him before you put the camera on me because I am not looking like I want to look well, I ain't looking bad but you know some things need to be secret <laughs> thankfully I am wearing a bra <laughs> and smooth her out and she's about to go from the to throw her in honey do you want to finish it or this is fine just leave it like this 
That's fine like it is. Just keep going. And do as I said. We start starting about 12 something, 12 something, 1 something, 2. If you want to cook it till it's very dark on top, near black, that's fine. It's going to be even juicier when you do that. You don't want to cook it. You don't want to take it out too soon. Okay. But that's what you do. Don't forget what you got. And God forbid if you do burn the top, rip off that burnt. The inside will be cooked. I mean, I did that once this year. Unfortunately, I had a funeral and I totally forgot what um totally forgot what I was doing. I'm going in the pot to get the rest of this out because that's how I do it. Yep. Don't find that spoon be too loud. Come on out now. There we go. I'm have to wash everything. All right, just leave them right there. There's some onions. Okay. And that's it. I'm going to put her in the oven, and hopefully I'll remember to show y'all. Thank y'all so much, and enjoy your meatloaf.